Trump's attorney calls for Comey to be investigated for illegal memo leak. President Trump's attorney called for an investigation into former FBI Director James Comey's illegal leak of his personal memos to the media. Talking to Sean Hannity, Jay Sekulow called on special counsel Robert Mueller to investigate Comey for leaking the contents of memos detailing several meetings and conversations with Trump. James Comey leaked information that he got in a meeting with the President of the United States. If there were an investigation going on right now, the investigation should be James Comey, he said. Seculo emphasized that Comey stored the memos on government property, leaking information from there to a friend at Columbia University to give to a New York Times reporter. The action was a violation of law, clearly, said Seculo. Comey revealed how he shared his memos in a Senate hearing earlier this month. Seculo said the so-called investigations of Russia interference in the election have been going on for nearly a year, yet there continues to be no smoking gun when it comes to the question of collusion by the Trump campaign. Watch the full Hannity interview above. Let's take a quick listen. Some of the geniuses were saying this morning, you know, from the time he announced on June 16th, two years ago, they've been hitting the hell out of him. Hillary took almost all negative ads. The problem was, when people went to vote, they didn't know what she stood for other than she was saying bad things about me. So from the time I announced, I've been hit, hit, hit. Then from the time I got in, I said, oh, this is gonna be great. Finally, we're gonna all come together. They hit me harder, harder, harder. They've now learned, I think, that that doesn't work. Apparently not. The president from earlier tonight taking a shot at the Democrats' very negative political strategy, no vision. Well, will we'll that stop trashing the administration? Maybe come up with a plan to help you. Jay Sekulow is with us, chief counsel for the American Center for Law and Justice, also now an attorney for the president. Uh, yes, That's so true. That's Georgia 6. But what bothers me is, okay, we go from one investigation, yeah. Russia collusion, then we move on to, oh, okay, that didn't work, let's try obstruction. Right. But the same guy that Comey sets yeah. it up, leaks information to the New York Times right. to get a special counsel, the guy that recommended to Comey that he, to Trump that he fire Comey, now gets Comey's friend, BFF, and then he goes hire all these people that donate to Obama yeah. Clinton and so, Clinton's lawyer. So what do we know? What's the one piece of evidence that we know in this entire case? What's the one thing we know for sure? James Comey leaked information on a, that he got on a meeting with the President of the United States. I want that to be very clear. A meeting with the President of the United States, he's taking notes. He puts the notes in after he gets into his car and writes these notes down. He takes those notes, puts them into his government car, into his government computer, into his government desk, which he then leaks from his government desk to his friend at the Columbia University Law Illegal. School. Illegal. Violation of the law, clearly. If there was an investigation that's going on right now, the investigation should be James Comey. I'm hopeful that it is. It sure should be. Because here's the reality. The only thing we know, you've had all of these congressmen, well, all of these senators. Well, that investigate is BFF. What's going to happen? Yeah. But, but here's the thing. That investigation actually is independent of this. So that investigation could go on within the context of the Department of Justice. We investigated Loretta Lynch for obstruction while we're at it? Well, here's the thing with Loretta Lynch. I mean, she got an absolute free. You talk about it, you know, it's not even fair to double standards to call it a double standard. But what we have to understand that's happened, and what is continuing to happen is, as these multiple track so-called investigations are going on, what do we know? You've had all these congressmen, all these senators, right, left, center, and they said, well, we haven't seen evidence of this, we haven't seen evidence of that, we really don't know, there's no smoking gun, We're, they've been doing this for 10 months, but we're acting like this is taking place in a vacuum. This has been going on for almost a year. Do you have any doubt at that the mishandling of classified information by Hillary, destruction of classified top speak secret special access program information by Hillary, um, the Clinton Foundation pay to play, 20% yeah. of our uranium signed off by her, uh, or Michael Flynn, violation of the Espionage Act, aren't they all felonies? Do you have any doubt well, felonies were committed? No, no question. I mean, here's the thing that absolutely made no sense on this. 
Of course, you, you left out the best one, which is the President of the United States, the former President of the United States, Bill Clinton, meeting on the tarmac with Loretta Lynch. It's called Why obstruction of justice. Well, if there was an obstruction of justice, that certainly would be it. Right. Okay. What happens on that matter? It wasn't an investigation. It was a matter. No, well, that's to me also another point. They will change the classification of what's going on when it suits their own narrative. But when it doesn't suit their narrative, they will... You know what James Comey suffers from? I've said this before. Selective disclosure. Right, I got a last question. Yeah. Is the president going to get rid of the Obama holdovers, the deep state, the selective leakers that are trying to hurt him every single solitary day? Do they go? They have to go because the reality is that's where... Look, we, we, we've gone past now the security leaks, right? Remember the beginning of the year, we were dealing with all of the leaks. And then that kind of got lost in all of this. But at, at the beginning of this was the problem of classified information being leaked to newspapers, to reporters, and so that's a leak. crime. And that's got... And that, you have These to, leaks are now coming from, from Mueller. This is special counsel. A leak. Well, you got you talking about anonymous sources. Yeah, yeah. Anonymous. no, not even not even anonymous sources. Anonymous sources from from who? From agencies they want to identify. Right. So what do you have here? This is you know the president uses the phrase witch hunt. I'm not sure it's fair witch hunts. What's going on right now? Good morning. I agree with you. Yeah. He needs to recuse himself. Mueller, get out. If there's too many conflicts of interest, and if you have any respect for the law, go. Same thing. Rosenstein, out. Absolutely. Yeah, respect for the law. Get out. Repeat That's right. Yourself. That's so true. Let us know what you think in the comments below. And thank you so much for watching.